Well folks, back out again with this man here. <laughs> the lovely bottom. <laughs> lovely plumage. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm out on the old uh, permission uh, down in Bergsteel. Um, a lovely sunny day. It's been a bit cloudy today, uh, but it's now brightened up so nice. It's really nice. Um, had to get out. It was time to get out, and uh, a good friend of mine, he wanted to get out, although he has got out one more in front of me, and uh, I'm a bit disgusted with him. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to turn you around and show you. I think it must be Blair O'Clock soon. Might be Blair O'Clock. Oh, yes. Forgotten. I'm out with this man, oh. Mr. Burton Outdoors. Afternoon. I'm so very pleased to see you, sir. And you. Yeah. Suiting. Good to see you again, mate. A long time. When was the last time we went out? November. Was it November? I think it was November. The, or the October. Lockdown. Before the last lockdown, wasn't it? Before this last Yeah, lockdown. yeah. It was just before, really, weren't it? Yeah. So, yeah. All, we, all, all we've been doing is walking around, really, isn't it? So, Not doing a lot, mate. No. Walking around, dreaming of camping. Yeah. <laughs> and here we are. Here we are. Shh. Yeah. <laughs> We're uh, socially distancing. Yeah. We're not touching each other yet. But look at Lee's setup, look. Maybe later. Yeah. What, what's this one called again, Lee? I don't know. This is it's the uh, throw together. The Lee setup. special. Lee special, and yeah. It's so working. It's low. It's, um, no, I, I actually got it off someone else, I, just, I can't claim credit for the actual setup. Yeah, I think I heard um, you say his name on your video. So. Uh, Richard Dayton. Yeah. 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 Um, I think if I was to do it again, I'd probably only use half the half the tarp underneath as right. a ground sheet. So I've got a ground sheet under there anyway, yep. which would then give you a bit more height. But it's quite warm in there, surprisingly so. Yeah, I bet. So, different one for me, I've done a few bivvy setups, but yeah. a different one. I always like your gear. <laughs> well, I don't buy a lot. No, no. I buy it and use it and keep it and use it. I don't. I don't sell it. I just buy. I try and buy the best that I can buy or what I think is the best. Yeah. DD tarp, they last forever. Yeah, good I mean, stuff they're not they the are. lightest thing in the world. Miltech Bivy, I actually love. Um, more so than the Dutch Army. Yeah. The Dutch Army is just too claustrophobic. I mean, you can put you can put that over your head or you can just have you can be out. Do you know, you, you say that about the Dutch Army, um, it's the only thing I've sold. I looked at mine and if I get on a white with this hunker, get rid of I might get rid of mine. Yeah, get good prices for them too. Yeah, I sold I'm mine too cheap. If you're listening Sonny, I sold yeah. mine too cheap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, old Sonny, he's got that, hasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, but that's Lee's set up. I won't say what Lee thought about his tarp and my tarp. I'll let you listen to what he says about... Well, you can. No, I shan't. <laughs> That's a good little setup, that is. I might have to do that next time I come down. It amazes me how much room they take up, though. Yeah. I mean, I've got the DD tarp setup, tarp tent. Pyramid, isn't it? Yeah, pyramid tarp tent. But look at that. I might hire it out for weddings. Yeah, I had the pole in there, with the shemug on the top there, in the middle, and I just thought I'd try it just off the ridge line. I don't know if you can see the ridge line there. Um, yeah, it's pretty alright. It's not too bad. It's nice and tight, I suppose. A bit tighter with the pole. But, oh! Now I'm getting old, it's hard to get in these things. But yeah, look, I've got a brand new out kit. Hunker XL Bivy. As you've just heard, I might consider getting rid of the um, Dutch Army Hoop Bivy if I like doing this uh, Bivy camp. And inside, I won't open it up yet, I'll show you later. I've got the Outkit Pipe Dream 400. Got the British Army um, inflatable, self inflatable mat in there and uh, a silver uh, reflective sheet and the German army um, ground mat which is the bizzo. Firewood, plenty of firewood, 
Lee cut all that down today. <laughs> <laughs> Got the food on the top there ready to go later. Burgers, bit of chilli cheese, couple of red onions, bit of bacon, eggs. Oh, I'm gonna have a field day. And Lee has got sausages, I do believe. Sausages. Sausages. This is the bizzo. Oh! Beer o'clock. Now I'm back on the beer. I've also got some beans for the morning. I might keep some of the bacon for the morning as well. A bit of bacon grill there. Pour for food. Yeah. Lee's gonna have a dump on the fire. Just taking a photo. Does he realise the gas is on? Nearly had me then. <laughs> yeah, so this is our little camp set up for the day and uh, for the night. Oh yeah, he's got his chair out. I must get mine out. Yeah, that's a bizzo. Looking forward to this. Not that it matters in here because uh, it's a permission. But that's just to see what it all looks like from a bit of a distance. As the old uh, year progresses and the summer progresses, um, it's going to look pretty good in there. Definitely going to do a hammock next time as well. Um, if I don't do lease set up, uh, I want to try my hammock again. Um, but yeah, that's how it all looks, folks. Our own little encampment. Right, we've done. We oh, hang on. As Lee goes one, two, three. Um, we've done a bit of a beer swap here. Uh, I'm back on the beer, not heavy, um, but yeah, done a bit of a beer swap, and I bought this one for Lee. Here we go. Here's Lee. If you didn't know already, but an outdoors, currently outdoors, about to open. Maybe a nasty beer. Here we go. So I have a big chug. Go on, chug. Oh, it is sour. Is it? It's nice though. Oh. Yeah, I was pulling them. Yeah, it is sour. <laughs> I do like a sour though. It's nice, There's isn't it? There's something about them, especially if you sit them. Chugging it, I'm not so sure. Oh, with the face. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice though. I think that's a 6.8. Six. Six. Yeah, you need new glasses. Yeah. <laughs> Still, six is alright. Good. That's good. Yeah. See, I like it. Yeah, look, there he is. Look, sat down. On the beer already, the beverage, and there's this man here, look, all healthy, making nettle tea. Something's not right. You're not a real bushcrafter. <laughs> Mr. Burton Outdoors has just said I'm not a real bushcrafter because <laughs> this is disgusting and. Uh, I'm now uh, going to go on the beer. <laughs> I've just pulled the same face that Lee pulled drinking that beer. Oh, that is absolutely gross. Can I just say? Cool. <laughs> Did it? Don't eat, don't drink it. Just eat them. It's disgusting. Hello, chef. Hello. <laughs> Do you want an egg? No. Well, you having an egg? Oh yeah. Do <laughs> <Go on. laughs> you want one? Yeah, got it. I might have to break it though, because I definitely need a bigger pan. Big in Japan. Okay. Got him? Yeah. Cool. Just a love egg. That's the love egg. That's the USB chargeable one. Right there. How are we getting on here? Someone's hanging up in your kitchen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's a fire going out, isn't there? Yeah. No. Got plenty of small ones still. Oh, a bit different now, Lee. Last time cooking in the dark. Yeah. I'm making you cook your own as well now. <laughs> Where are you going to cook them? I was going to. 
That's a nice little pan though. Yeah, you just got to watch your bloody rubber hand. Yeah. Are they not silicon? Well, yeah, they do burn. They'll yeah. still like, not touch a little bit. Is it? I know other people say it, and I don't want to be stealing what they say, because if you're stuck at home looking at us doing this, get your backsides out and give it a go, because it's yeah. blooming good fun. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you can see me. Am I in shot there? You should be. Am I in shot? I'll tell you what. Let's see if Lee's in shot. You see my egg? You see my egg? You need to get down and get down, that's it, you're there. <laughs> yeah, get out and do it. Just not on our land. <laughs> get off my land. Boy girls and an egg. <laughs> People were saying this handle gets hot, but yours don't because it's a lucky one. It's a lucky one. We're going for it. Go for it. I just realised that oh, I'll probably have to use your scratch. We're going to get it out, are we? Get it out. No. Oh, I'm cut mine, Let's cut mine, actually. Just a scratch if you want to do. Thank you. Let's just catch fire now. Yeah, put it in. Yeah, I'm going to put it in. They are sharp, aren't they? What? The oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> I don't care. Joe. Yeah, wind's changed direction now. What's it doing? It's doing what it does best, finding us. Oh, it's going to be a right dirty burger. Yeah, it's going to go everywhere. I love them. What are you after? I'm gonna get this out. I can't. Do you want me to hold it? Stickage. I know that's going over. Holy oh. shit! Have another one. Do another egg. No. Oh yeah, Do another egg. Whose idea was it for an egg? 
<laughs> now that'll be as black as you're at, you down got, there. Yeah, you've got to uh, cut cheese. Yeah, I ain't cut it. Let me cut it. Oh, okay. oh do you want to see? Look. Nice. Mmm. Beautiful. That was freshly made today, he said. Very good. Good. Very good. Have you? No. Oh, it has? Mm. Oh, good. I don't know whether you can see me or not. But that is lovely. Steak burger. This is so wrong, so very wrong. What did you say the time was, Mr. Burton Outdoors? Um, 12. 10 past 12. 10 past 12, midnight. Mm. And we're cooking burgers. We should be tucked up in bed. Anybody who says, us old fogies uh, don't last the night, wrong. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, and I'll leave that in. <laughs> no, maybe not. <laughs> Ciao for now. <laughs> Three oh five AM and uh still up, although we're in bed. Not together, I must stress. <laughs> um yeah, Mr. Burton outdoors is uh across the way. I'm just tucked in now. Uh Alp Kit Pipe Dream four hundred and Alp brand new Hunker uh, XL Bivy. Um, Lee said, "Take your trousers off," so I did. I <laughs> <laughs> didn't know what to expect next, but no, he said, "Take your trousers off because uh, it'd be a lot warmer for you." <laughs> Normally, I sleep in me uh, in my trousers, but uh, no, I took them off tonight. Long johns on. And uh, yeah, it does. Uh, it's more beneficial straight away. You can tell it's it's, it's more beneficial. So anyway, I'm going to uh, hunker down in the hunker, and uh, I shall see thee all in the morrow. Good night, Mr. Burton Outdoors. Good night. <laughs> he had to think my name then, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, it's getting late. <laughs> see you in the morning, folks. I don't know what time it'll be, but it'll be the morning. Well, that's another camp over, folks. You can see someone's shoulder there. There he is. It was a lovely camp again tonight. Tonight? Tonight. Should we stay another night? Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good camp last night, Lee, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. I look like a midget. Dear. Let's... Oh, no. Yeah, I've got to go down, haven't I? <laughs> go down. We didn't do much going down. <laughs> Social distancing and all of that. Yeah. No, good camp last night. Mm. Plenty of chatting. And as Lee will say on his video, uh, it was a late one. We yeah. did have a late chat. Uh, two and a half hours later than the last yeah. one. Yeah, but it was good. There had plenty to talk about. Well, Lee did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, thanks for coming down again, Lee. Safe trip home, mate. And uh, we'll have to come down here again in the not too distance. Take it easy, folks. Bye.